I would love to hear legit logic on how Shaquille O'Neal was not the best player in the game. He couldn't hit free throws. Okay. Right? You had something that could actually, you could actually take him out the game with. Shaq was everything, what, five feet in. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Had no mid-range game, no long game. Mm-hmm. And when you look at other guys, you had other guys that were more skilled than Shaq, but he was just so big and strong. Mm-hmm. Shaq could do anything with you. But then when you put him against guys like Hakeem and skilled mm-hmm. big men that could take him away from the basket and expose him a little bit, he mm-hmm. did have problems. But Shaq dominated the era because he was so big and so strong. Right. It was just impossible for dudes to really control him physically. Shaq, for his size, had great footwork. Shaq was a great transition player. Shaq made free throws when they counted. I remember him icing a bunch of games at the free throw line. He made free throws when they counted. He might not have been great, but he did make free throws when they counted. The point of the game is to put the ball in the basketball and to prevent the other team from doing that. There's a misconception that skill or talent makes you the best, and it doesn't.